Hi there, it's Julie Lee with Issaquah Mile Fascia Release. Welcome back. Today we're going to go over a gentle exercise for scapular mobility to improve shoulder mobility. Um, this can be a little confusing if you haven't done anything like this. We're going to use a foam roll and we're going to be face down, prone, okay? Um, just because you may not be able to hear me as well as I'm face down, I'm going to show you. This is coming from the scapula. So what we're going to do as we inhale, we're going to roll the roll away from us by making contact with our forearms. It's not coming from the hands and it's not coming from the forearm. It's coming from the ability to move your scapula up the spine. So as you inhale, the scapula are going to separate and move up. Okay, it's going to look something like that. As we exhale, we're going to imagine that we can slide the scapula back into our back pocket. So it's not coming from the front of the shoulder, it's coming from the back of the body. It looks something like this. As we inhale, we're going to push away. As we exhale, we're going to slide it back into our pocket. All right, so we're going to be face down. And as you do this, your feet can be separated or apart, however it feels right for you. Try not to let your low back sag. You want to maintain a neutral spine and engage that coat contraction from your belly and then to the paraspinal so that everything in your core is engaged. Okay, you want to be nice and taut. Forearms, about mid forearms is where the foam roll is going to be. So your head is going to be in a neutral spine. Um, it's not going to be on the floor. You're going to be just raising up. So you're going to be engaging your paraspinals and your cervical spine as well. All right. So you're going to take a deep breath in. As you inhale, you're going to roll the roll away from you by separating your scapula and allowing them to slide up the body. As you exhale, bring the scapula back down. Imagine that you can tuck it right back in your back pocket. We're going to do five. Inhale, push away. Exhale, roll back. Inhale, push away. Exhale, back into the pocket. Work with the range that's available for you. Inhale, push away. Exhale, and back down the spine. One more. Inhale, push away. Exhale, scapula roll back into the pocket. Okay. What did you notice? Was that easier than you thought, or did it produce pain or pinching in the front? If you're not able to extend your arms all the way, then we'll need to develop a modification for you. Contact me if you have questions. Start with just a few reps, and do just a few so that you can focus, up, focus and emphasize quality over quantity. Once you are able to replicate the movement more and more, then you can ex start expand the, the reps and the sets. I would start with three to six, um, and then add another set and another set so that you can do about three sets of six reps is, is a good place to start. Um, you can also combine these with other exercises that will be in the mobility folder. It piggybacks with a lot of the Pilates exercises that we've been working on, the mat Pilates. Contact me if you have questions or need modifications. I'm here to help.